milking the traditional way. Premila Ben Patel and millions of Indian women are often the ones who spearhead milk production at village level. She began in 1966 with one cow. She now has 15. She's one of more than 3 million in Gujarat state and 50 million across India. She's part of a cooperative, a system that's been growing in popularity amongst Indians for the past 40 years. It takes time to build up a herd like this, but with the cooperative support, I'm now earning enough money to educate my family. My daughter has just come back from America as a qualified pharmacist. While milk yields per head are traditionally low, quality is high. Farmers only used what was produced for their own needs. Any excess was sold locally. With the cow a commodity and breeding techniques improving, so has the increase in herds and milk. Excess milk is being collected in milk stations like this. Tested and weighed, each farmer's contribution is computerized. These people are also the owners of the cooperative. 80% of the cost price to the consumer goes back to the farmer. India's milk production is set to increase according to government figures in the next 12 months. India is seen as a possible global provider in the light of recent contamination scares in China and New Zealand. Its producers are confident they're up to the challenge. I expect next five years, the way farmers are getting encouraged because of good price, we expect minimum 5% per annum increase in production. And by 2020, our milk production should reach to 200 metric tons. I am very sure. The strength of the Indian milk industry is that farmers seem to prefer to organically raise their herds. Advanced mechanization for the collection and processing of milk has made the product safer for consumption in India and abroad. India's milk production has increased threefold over the last 30 years. It certainly has the capacity to produce milk for its own people and for the export market. So if there is a contamination crisis elsewhere in the world, India could well come to the rescue. Sahil Rahman, Al Jazeera, Ahmedabad, Gujarat.